before I go tonight and um, get into the night air, I just wanted to just drop a really quick word. Um, uh, you know, just be aware of people who, um, you know, make it a point to, you know, watch your every move. I mean, it be through social media, um, but they never have anything to say. But when they see you out in public, they kind of feel obligated to say, oh yeah, I saw what you posted and that was really cool. Like I like that artwork or whatever. Um, these people aren't for you. And also, um, this is a huge dead giveaway that they don't have good intentions for you. So be aware of people who um, ask you how you're doing, but they offer nothing about themselves. Um, they're just fishing for information. And this happened to me a couple of days ago and like I just saw him a bunch of gibberish because I knew exactly what he was doing. And then when I asked him, so how are you doing? He rolled his eyes at me and um, enough said. So, um, you know, things are um, shaking up a little bit. Um, I can only imagine like if we were to see like a satellite view of the world, like what it would look like. It's gotta be pretty crazy. Like, I can imagine like just like sparks and like like flashes of like crackle and cackle and smoke like all over the place. But, um, you know, I, there's also um, some other things that I've noticed like, um, and you guys have heard this uh, many times, I'm sure, but um, you know, uh, people are kind of duplicitous. Like they say one thing, like I knew a girl, <clears throat> she said she was vegan and she had no issues eating a steak a burrito um, along with a, a basically a walking contradiction. I kept thinking to myself like, eh, I feel like this girl's really narcissistic. Well, that right there should have been the biggest, 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 um, huge banner, like, this girl's a narcissist. Um, amongst other things, there's just like always chaos and discord and wherever the group that this particular person like roams around in, there's always like, you know, falling apart between relationships because a lot of women, they um, use relational aggression to, especially like highly narcissistic, like that whole mean girl thing to sort of, um, you know, isolate uh, people that don't. Uh, do what they want or people that they can't control or people that they're envious of or whatever um, really petty uh, reason they may have but um, yeah I just um, watch out for that and then um, I know this is going to sound petty on my end but the longer the socks on the girl like if she's got those socks that come up to her knees no good can come out of that and with that said I gotta go um, I hope you guys have a wonderful night um, my name of course is Shadea the lesbian believer and um Hopefully you guys have a wonderful Sunday. You know, I'm looking forward to tonight. Um, you know, I always thank God every morning when I get up and um, I just, you know, I talk to God like he's like my best friend. So it's, it's nice to, you know, have um, like the best, um, you know, sort of protection and uh, the best confidant. Um, I learned a long time ago, you know, a lot of people, they get entertainment off of your folly, so. You know, you have to be very careful um, with who you share information with because um, a lot of people are looking for, um, you know, clout or whatever. But I'm sure a lot of you guys have been through a lot of this because this is really going on and like, you know, it seems like we all are having some experiences that are making us go, hmm, you know, watch that. Anyways, I'm really out of here. Cheers.